Hello loves, Janine Brown of JTB Love Ministry and welcome back to my channel. Hey, Happy New Year, Happy New Year. I pray God gives you tremendous blessings in the new year and that you have supernatural favor in Jesus' holy name. Now, I woke up this morning and I was intending to upload uh, a video that I have uh, continuing with the uh, T.D. Jakes saga. However, it was just, it's just odd because I woke up and immediately Fantasia came into my spirit. And so I got out my notepad on my phone and I just started writing. And uh, this is what came into my spirit and um, it just flowed. So um, that's what this video is about today. I love my girl Fantasia ever since I saw her on American Idol and, you know, where she came from, you know, not having a, a high school diploma, having a kid at an early age. And she just loved the Lord and she was just so humble. And uh, you could just see her heart. It just shone right through. Um, however, I fear for her because of the associations, all of the accolades and things like that, that are going on, you know, after the color purple and her performance. So, um let's get to it okay first corinthians 10 12 quote therefore let him who thinks he stands take heed lest he fall i know uh fantasia prays before she goes out on concerts and stuff like that and um she believes the holy spirit is keeping her lifted up and showing her the way but when you start mixing with the devil's folks that can open up a whole bunch of portals so folks Fantasia's pursuit of fame and fortune right, fortune right now is not sinful, but it becomes sin when you want to be liked, adored, and honored by the world more than God. 1 Timothy 6, 9, quote, but people who long to be rich fall into temptation and are trapped by many foolish and harmful desires that plunge them into ruin and destruction, end quote. That's my concern about Fantasia. The crowd worship, the money, the invites from the rich and famous leads to desires and temptations that can trap, ruin, and destroy and cause Fantasia to walk away from God. Matthew 6, 24 reminds us, quote, you cannot serve both God and money, end quote. How does Fantasia, who I believe has a heart for God, keep her eyes on God while being seduced by all the Hollywood trappings of the powerful, rich, and famous, and surrounded by all the Satanism. Fantasia is dressing to impress the world. She is all over social media, wearing and showcasing the latest styles with breasts exposed from the devil's designers. Right now, Fantasia is still a country bumpkin at heart, okay? And the reason why I say that is, I don't know if you guys saw the uh, video where um, Taraji um, would, uh, after they would finish on the set, uh, she would ask, uh, Fantasia to come on out with them and drink. And Fantasia would keep saying, I got to go and feed my dog. I got to go home and feed my dog. Well, come to find out she never had a dog. And I believe Fantasia was doing that because she did not want to go hang out in the bars and drink. That's just not her. And I'm just praying. I want you guys to keep her lifted up in prayer that she does not succumb to all of the Satanism and the demonism that can get into her spirit by hanging around with, you know, people like Oprah, okay, um, which we know is a true demon spirit. Uh, I fear for her, okay? What will the future bring when you continue to hang in these circles? Galatians 1.10, quote, for am I now seeking the approval of man or of God? Or am I trying to please man? If I were still trying to please man, I would not be a servant of Christ, end quote. Whitney Houston is a prime example of how fame and fortune does not bring happiness because you walk away from God and it will destroy you. Whitney destroyed herself, her God-given voice because of the drug abuse and her relationship with those Hollywood entertainers. And although... In her hypocrisy, hypocrisy, she was always singing and talking about God while having her drugs in one hand and the Bible in the other. In fact, I believe the photos of her room when she died had a Bible 
right next to the drugs she was using. John 12, verse 43, quote, for they love the glory that comes from man more than the glory that comes from God, end quote. Whitney, dead at the young age of 48, she sold her soul, her God-given talent to the devil, and what a tragedy, because that curse became generational and took her daughter at the young age of 22, also by drowning and drug intoxication, just like Whitney. I fear for Fantasia's daughter, Zion, who in the recent pics I saw, she is dressing like the world. She's 19 years old. She's in a red, red off-the-shoulder dress, barely covering the behind. Okay, that concerns me. That's not Jesus. First John 2, verses 15 through 16, quote, Do not love the world or the things in the world. If anyone loves the world, the love of the Father is not in him. For all that is in the world, the, the desires of the flesh and the desires of the eyes and pride of life is not from the Father, but is from the world, end quote. In the entertainment industry, Fantasia is surrounded by demonic spirits whenever she is in their company. All the applause, the accolades, the admiration, the Golden Globe and Academy Award nominations, they are touching her, kissing, hugging her. It's the devil's version of, quote, laying on of the hands, end quote, and that the Bible warns us about. And those spirits can enter Fantasia. Fantasia, Fantasia must be careful of the spirit she is submitting herself to, like Oprah, because whenever, whatever spirit is in them, can transfer to Fantasia. And that's what concerns me. Ephesians 5, verses 11 through 13, and have no fellowship with the unfruitful works of darkness, but rather expose them. For it is shameful even to speak of those things which are done by them in secret. And we know what is done by Hollywood in secret. But all things that are exposed are made manifest by the light, for whatever makes manifest is light. And we know Jesus is on the move. He's exposing a whole lot of these celebrities um, and more is to come. I'm going to be watching my girl Fantasia and I pray that she keeps her eyes on Jesus. And I encourage all of my listeners, saints, keep her lifted up. We don't need Fantasia to fall. We don't need Fantasia who loves the Lord. And I know she does because she, with the way she sings, she sings from the soul, but she can fall. All of us can by hanging with the wrong people. What fellowship does or communion does light have with darkness? She has none. And I, I, I'm just concerned. So I'm going to be watching my girl. Okay. Um, Deuteronomy 818 Fantasia. If you happen to see this video, but remember the Lord, your God for it is he who gives you the ability to produce wealth, end quote, not the world. God bless everybody. And thank you for listening.